Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here and welcome back to our channel 14 Let's Play where guys, my final hammer of heroes is here. And I say final because I don't have enough medals as of right now to uh, to actually get another hammer later. But I'm assuming because of CWL happening that I will have more hammers very soon. Or not, well, yeah, more, more hammers, but more medals is what I mean. So guys, I'm going to grab a hammer of heroes right now that brings my medals down to 21, which is awful. I can't afford anything else, <laughs> which is insane. But guys, I've been telling you for episodes now, episodes now. And if you guys haven't subscribed and you haven't been watching previous videos, Please do so. Hit that subscribe button because and ring the bell for notifications because we have an ongoing story of content here on this channel. And guys, today uh, we're going to be using this hammer to max out my royal champion. And I'm going to do it at the beginning of the video because I want to use it in today's video. I want the maxed out ability and uh, the maxed out... Uh, uh, stats let's just say that so uh guys royal champion going to level 30 maxed out 100 let's go in three two one bam there we go i accidentally missed the button with my one finger so i had to use the other finger uh but there we go guys royal champion is done so if i go into my progress base i can actually grab the altar and move it across because it is now 100 done look at that royal champion no upgrade button left oh that's super exciting all right so you you royal champion get oh come on What's, I think it's the owl. I think the owl's in the way. There we go. All right. So royal champion, come hang out with the, the queen. There you go. You ladies hang out over here. I got to keep working on the guys. Um, and uh, royal, warden, come on, man. I think it's the owl interfering with my uh, my clicking. But there we go. So now we have the warden waking up in 24 hours. I've got enough elixir to upgrade him again. I may or may not actually do it. We'll see. And I've got the king now that we have to focus on. He needs... Uh, a bunch of upgrades, so it's gonna be it's still a process. We get we got a, a ways to go Also, we still have Lassie upgrading in the pet house So we have two days for that. So today I'm basically gonna focus on getting one or two more builders busy so Also, obviously demonstrating the royal champions. Let's go do some raids um, I've got the uh, the Yeti smash as normal, but I'm excited about specifically focusing and paying attention to the Royal Champion Seeking Shield ability. I cannot wait for that because it's just, it's got a bonus. I don't know. I, I didn't look at how much of a boost it gave me, but it gave me a boost and that's what I love. So cannot wait to see that guys. Uh, I'm going to focus on gold because I think gold is the, probably the only way I'm going to be able to spend or use up both of my builders today. So let's focus on gold. I'm passing a lot of bases with lots of gold, but I want to find one base with like a stupid amount of gold. Okay. So that's my goal. So I'll be right back guys. Once I find that and, uh, uh, we will smack it together and enjoy Max Royal Champion. I think 700,000 is a good enough amount to say stupid amount, right? Because with the loot bonus, this should get me to a million gold, okay? And I'm attacking Edison. Thanks a lot for the light bulb, buddy. So yeah, uh, let's smack this base. I am going to stare at it for just a second and figure out where I want to go. Actually, I'm going to come in from... Oh, this is actually a terrible base to attack with this strategy. Uh, as long as I can get it started, I should be okay. So, queen, balloon, and healers. Okay, so I'm kind of just going to wait. Actually, you know what? No, no, no. I've actually got to get... Uh, oh, no, I don't care about iPad storage. That was weird. Uh, I want to deploy the wall breakers and break the queen in. Right. Oh, but the stupid... Uh, okay, I just lost a bunch of wall breakers. And I'm not going to be able to break into the wall now. Which means I need to cut off this base way over here. Because... Uh, yeah, I want this queen to get this air defense, not this air defense to get this queen. So let's actually drop this rage spell. Okay, um, I, I need a, a few wizarding things to focus on the air defense. In fact, you know what? Um, baby dragon, go for the air defense. Go, go, go. You're raged up. You should be fine. Get it, get it, get it. Yes! Okay, that was awesome. Okay. So, uh, uh, jump spell. Okay, okay. Um, yetis, bowlers, king, royal champion. Okay, I've got everything. Except uh, the queen's not going into the base and she's still getting wrecked by stuff. Come on, man. All right, let's actually freeze over this inferno tower. Um, I've got this jump spell, so we should be good there. Let's pop this king's ability. I don't know where he is, but let's get him. Oh, he's way out there. Wow. Okay, this is an awful attack. <laughs> this base is terrible. Or not this base, but like this attack is terrible. Okay, um, you know what? Let's go. There we go. Quad quake. I missed the royal champion's ability. This attack has gone so badly that I totally lost all focus and everything. Um, I've got three archers left. That's all I've got to redeem myself. Okay, uh, archers, 
There's nothing you can do, buddies. I'm sorry. Uh, let's pop this. Let's drop this rage spell. Uh, poison spell even. Can I use it? Oh, everything ran out of the rage. Oh my gosh. This is literally everything has gone wrong in this raid. Everything. Uh, I don't, I don't know what to do. Uh, I guess poison spell over this clan castle because the clan castle deserves it. Uh, I don't know what to, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. That was so bad. I mean, here's what went wrong. The wall breakers, that, that ruined me right there. That, that one little bomb that killed all of my wall breakers ruined everything, okay? Um, because I wanted the queen to be able to go right at that air defense. But as soon as that happened, I got flustered and I started just throwing stuff around. You gotta keep your head and you gotta focus on what, the, on the matter at hand, right? The matter at hand is get those troops and deploy them correctly. Now, fortunately, I still have over 70%, so I will get a full loot bonus, but I won't be able to get, like, the gold in these two storages, which is probably a decent amount, and, um, probably nothing of note in the gold mines, honestly, if I had to guess. Let's just see. Yeah, there's probably, like, 20,000 gold or something in the gold mines, so that ain't gonna do me any good. Ooh, look at all these Yeti mites. Yeah, get some, get some defenses down, homies. Yeah. Oh, wow, that air defense actually, or that uh, arch tower actually went down. That was amazing. Um, let's just get these, get this gold mine down, and that's going to be it for me in this raid. Unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, that was not the way it was supposed to go, okay? Not the way it was supposed to go. But again, okay, okay, th this is the best part about this situation. That, yes, that did not go according to plan, but I have a great loot bonus, okay? I used to think that chilling in Crystal League was the best. But if you fail in Crystal League, you don't get any loot. But in this, I kind of failed. I got almost 80%. I mean, that wasn't like a full-on fail, but it wasn't good. But with the loot bonus, this was still over 600,000 gold. That's not a small number. So even though I failed, the loot bonus being in Titan League 2 really helps me out a lot. So I'm, I'm going to be satisfied. I'm going to choose to be satisfied with that amount of loot. I'm going to request for some CC troops. And, um, although I'm not going to depend on them because I'm going to go straight out there and redeem myself with an army of miners, okay? Uh, I've got a wall breaker, a wall wrecker, so I can use that to kind of lead the way. Although, I don't have any heroes. I might not even need the wall wrecker. I'll have to, I'll have to decide in the moment, okay? I have to decide in the moment. Because I'm going to try to find a base that's got lots of gold again this time. It's all, all miners, no heroes, no CC. So, it, the goal this time will be one star. <laughs> the goal... Will not be a three star like in that previous raid. But have you guys had that before? Where it felt like everything kind of went wrong during your raid and you're like, I don't even know. I just got to keep going. Because unfortunately, if that has ever happened to you, then you must be a human. Yeah, you must You must be a human. You must be capable of making mistakes. <laughs> like I am. <laughs> anyway. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. I forgot. I forgot. You, you guys are perfect, right? You guys don't make mistakes. I, I forgot about that. My bad. That was my bad. See, I make mistakes. I'm human. <laughs> Have I made my point yet? Anyway, guys, I'm gonna try. Ooh, yes. Okay. Triple eight base. This is a rarity. Uh, this is a rarity. Okay. Let me see. Can I? Yes, I've got my siege barracks. I can actually have some extra troops with that. I'm gonna focus on gold, like I was talking about. So let's actually drop four miners on either one of these storages, okay? And that should get all of it. And then I'm thinking about focusing on this entire side because there's a dark elixir storage and two gold storages. So you're going to, yeah, okay, we got that. No problem. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's do this. Let's put the miners all across this right corner here. And I'm also going to drop the siege barracks just to have some extra firepower. Okay, poison this queen, heal into the core. We're dealing with all the heroes, but fortunately they're not like super strong, okay? They're weak heroes. So that, that should help a lot. Wait, did I forget to put the poison? I could have sworn that I put the poison down. That was weird. Okay, well, here's the heal. Not really trying to get to the town hall, but at this point now, I'm just trying to keep troops alive so I may get to 50%, because I might not. Uh, but this base had 800,000 gold. I'm already down to 250 left, so that means that I got, what, like 550,000 gold? That's not a small number. I keep saying it, and it's true. So, there you go, guys. That was, uh, that was a fun one. I, I, I love whenever, um, I can use an, a, a, an attack like that. Like, the minor attack where you just, you just put them and they go. Like, you don't have to think about walls. You don't have to think about defenses or whatever. It's just let the miners do what they do best. It's just great. So, I'm gonna poison over this tornado trap. Hopefully, I can slow it down. That would be cool. I just came up with a new update idea. Okay, new update idea. If you see the tornado trap, you can put the poison spell over the tornado trap to slow it down and then your troops can get out. You 
can't tell me that's not a smart idea. Most people wouldn't do it, I don't think, but some might. I mean, some might, like me right there. I, I had an extra poison spell. I figured, you know what? <laughs> Throw it on the tornado trap. That's actually not a bad idea. Let's all send this to Supercell, okay? Let them get, oh, get help it to get their attention. Like the video and and uh, and share it and um, and and tag them on Twitter. Turns out they pay more attention to their Twitter than you would think. So do that. Follow me on Twitter too. Links in the description. But anyway, six hundred thirty thousand gold, not too bad. Poison spells on tornado traps. I I think that this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. I do, I do. Anyway, so let's begin now by uh, getting some upgrades done. So first things first, I need to get this final Builder Hut upgrading. So that's awesome because now they're all defenses and can do crazy amounts of damage. I mean, this, this upgrade here gives me 50 DPS and defense repair. So that's huge. That's a huge benefit that I don't have yet. So 9.5 million gold, 10 day upgrade, 3, 2, 1, bam. Okay, and then uh, again, I've got 24 hours until this Grand Warden is done, so that's awesome. I would like to do another defense. Can I afford anything? I know there's some cheap stuff in here that I might can do. This bomb is 1.2 million, and it's a, th wow, it's a three day. That's impressive. Uh, okay, so if I collect this treasure, that should be get me to that point. Yes, okay, cool. So I can use the ball six builders. It's been a while since I've done this. So bomb level seven, wow. This is not even close to maxed. Uh, three day upgrade, 1.2 million gold. But then, before I do that, I do want to spend a little bit of my elixir, okay? Because I have uh, a lot of elixir and I don't need it all. In fact, the question is, how much was this Grand Warden upgrade? I don't remember. I mean, I could probably get away with spending 5 million or so elixir safely. Let's go ahead and do that, yeah. So each one of these is a million. So if I select five of them okay i'll just do it individually just go ahead and do five of these walls all one million a piece i've also got some wall rings i should probably use while i'm here so let's uh select these i don't know how many i have so this might be a little bit more than i was expecting but you don't ever want to use a wall ring unless the wall is at least a million loot to upgrade okay uh because even if it's a really low level wall and it's going to take you like a quarter of a million or like 10,000 gold or whatever, it's still going to use up your wall ring, but your wall ring is good for a million loot. So don't use a wall ring unless the upgrade is at least a million, okay? Uh, oh, and that appears to be the last of my wall rings. Cool. So I've I've gotten all my walls down to level uh, 11, all the new ones. So that's awesome. Okay. So uh, yeah, let's upgrade this bomb and then go away from there. So three day upgrade, 1.2 million gold, 3, 2, 1, bam. Nice. Okay. So accumulating dark elixir. I need... Uh, Probably not a lot, actually. Yeah, probably only like 10 or 20 more thousand Dark Elixir to be able to upgrade the uh, Lassie again. Or if I end up with enough Dark Elixir, upgrade the uniform Unicorn again. Not the Uniform, that's different. Uh, 230,000 Dark Elixir. I'll be wa watching the Grand Warden to upgrade him again very, very soon. And yes, I realize I should upgrade these Valkyrie, or these Minions, sorry. But uh, I just don't have, I, I have much higher priorities than that right now. So, uh, yeah, we're doing great. We're getting along. Thank you for the CC, WHP. You're absolutely amazing. I'll use them in my next raid off camera because this is all for today. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already for daily gaming videos. Remember to uh, share this video with Supercell because, hey, poison spells and tornado traps. That's a thing. It needs to be a thing. It's not very useful, but it's still cool. And uh, use code Klaus if you guys decide to buy something in the game. Just remember that a small percentage of every purchase is sent to the content creator you choose to support with your creator code. So if you choose to support me, again, use code Klaus. It's a huge blessing. Thank you from me and all other content creators who you use their codes for. It's a huge blessing. Thank you all so much. Just remember that the code does expire after seven days. So go into your shop. Look for that little creator code C at the top right-hand corner. Uh, mine's gone, obviously, so I would use the link in the description to input the code automatically, and that's if I'm on a mobile device, or uh, do it manually in the settings, which is the way I like to do it. So go into your settings, go to more settings, and then scroll down to the very bottom under Creator Boosted Enter Code Klaus. Um, and remember that it works in every single Super Soul game, not just Clash of Clans. So if you guys decide to, if you play those, or if you decide to decide to buy something in them, and you choose to use Code Klaus. Thank you all so much for doing that. That's all for me for today, guys. Remember that I love each and every one of you. And uh, I'll see you all again next time.